All right, I just want to do a little recap of this week in case you missed anything. But this week we're working on Rube Goldberg Creations and the engineering design process. So we talked about what is a Rube Goldberg machine. We introduced you to Rube Goldberg, the cartoonist that was famous for his intricate designs for simple tasks. We watched the Guinness Book of World Records machine and talked about the common materials that we noticed, as well as things that wowed us. And then we started talking about energy transfers. Um, the assignment for the energy transfers to was, was to watch the OK Go and do the Ed Puzzle that was assigned. We also gave you time to gather materials, if you remember. And then the next day, um, we were talking about perhaps gathering more materials and creating a simple machine that has at least five distinct separate steps. In addition to that, we discussed the importance of simple machines and how to utilize them in a Rube Goldberg machine. And we talked about those things as well as watched videos on how to build your own Rube Goldberg machine. So once you watched your how to build a Rube Goldberg machine, you said go ahead and tinker more and create and looking around your house for different supplies and then thinking about maybe a final task that you were going to do. The third class period was spent going ahead and drawing your own simple cartoon and being able to add a narrative about your drawing or your sketch and you had the opportunity to think about your final task that you were actually going to do for your Rube Goldberg final project or just being imaginative. And so if we go into our Google Classroom, um, that Rube Goldberg sketch is going to be due the before the final project. Um, there's also just practicing chain reactions. And you were supposed to add a video to Flipgrid recording your five chain reaction. Um, the Tinker and Play, that was just, you know, playtime. You can watch the Joseph's Machine, the YouTuber that specializes in Rube Goldberg. Um, the Ed Puzzle video was due. There are slides linked in case you want to view any of those things. So, really, the essentials for that first week of Rube Goldberg is that you do the Ed Puzzle video about energy as well as record a flip grid for the five chain reaction. And if you're in hours one, two, and three, you were assigned to go ahead and create a sketch of a Rube Goldberg machine, including a narrative. We also talked about the expectations for a Rube Goldberg machine. And so if you were part of the first, second, and third hour classes, we talked about what our final machine will be like, and I will be sharing that out next week. Hopefully this helps.